Hi everyone! So as you've seen from the thumbnail, I'm here with some very, very exciting num num snackables today. Um, so I have four packs of the slime sundaes. And these were a really cool find actually. I was on Instagram and I was looking under the num num snackables kind of like hashtag. Um, and I found a shop that had these. Now these are so hard to find. I don't know if they were ever in the UK. Um, I don't remember seeing them to be honest. They were in America, but even then I think they were hard to find. Again, probably just in certain shops or there wasn't many or something like that. Um, but I found this store and um, they're all the way in Lebanon. And I thought I would just ask, you know, I, I, said, I sent a message and said, if you have Num Num Snackables still in stock, uh, would you consider shipping to the UK? And they replied and said, yes, have you paid the cost? And I said, yes, absolutely. You know, I don't expect anyone to pay shipping out of pocket, especially international. Um, and yeah, I had a discussion and I spoke to this absolutely lovely person. I want to say their name is Pamela. I may be wrong on that, but I just saw some emails. I think it was someone called Pamela who filled out the customs form. So I'm going to assume I was talking to a lady called Pamela. Even if that's wrong, whoever I spoke to, though, was absolutely lovely, incredibly helpful. And it was something that we arranged over some days because there was some um, difficulties trying to work out like the shipping costs. Long story short, it all worked out in the end. Um, shipping was expensive, but the items were reasonably priced. So it all kind of balanced out and they were still much cheaper than, you know, where I found them elsewhere. Because sometimes these pop up on eBay, but oh gosh, eBay fees and then extra taxes and a uh, global shipping program usually is a small fortune. So I was really happy to get all of these. You also got a couple of little slime kits as well. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to open these up today and just give a massive shout out to the company and in particular, like I said, Pamela or whoever it was that I was speaking to because they were so nice, so helpful. And I don't know, I just feel like you don't often get such good customer service. I don't, I just feel like lately, especially, I don't know it's just this country, but nobody seems to really care about their jobs and just Pamela went to so much effort to actually you know, check what items and then message the shipping companies and all of that and I just want to say that was very appreciated so I will link their Instagram down below so this is the uh, mint chocolate chip one obviously this is the strawberry banana sundae which sounds like my sort of thing this one I think is the birthday one makes sense because you have the little candle tropical yeah so really excited for these they look so nice in the packaging I almost don't want to open them but I think they're going to look really cute actually just displaying all of this stuff and I want to get the little num nums out as well only just open the packaging just like you know that much and I can already smell I'm opening, I think it's a tropical one first wow um, so we have a checklist here. Now this is the same checklist as the slime kit ones and it makes a lot of sense now because I was opening all of these slime kits with the bottles and I was so confused about why I wasn't getting any of like these sweet ones and it's because they come in these sets. So these checklists are very confusing though to be honest like because they kind of combine multiple different series in one and like you have the birthday cake set on here as well. So here is the first num num. So this is a little lollipop. Let's see if she smells. Oh wow, my god, that's so strong. I think it's raspberry. It reminds me ever so slightly of this medicine I had as a kid, but also but in a much nicer way. Oh, it's meant to be cherry, okay. So this is called Bunny Pop. I love that, it's such a cute little uh, lollipop, that's adorable. And then we have the actual um, container. Now I'm definitely gonna be keeping this and storing this. Um, you know, you only get a couple of nom noms with these, but I actually really like the little glass. It's really cute. And I can't decide whether to keep the card in or not, um, because you could have the card in or you've got these little pots of slime. Um, but yeah, this is so cute. And you get a little spoon as well. So yeah, so we do have pots of slime. Now I don't think I'm gonna open these. I would only really open slime if there's like a character inside, but I don't think there is. Um, but that's that one, so I might pop that actually in at the bottom. And then we also have this slime here. Do these have names, by the way? Um, so it's meant to be raspberry and peach. Oh, so something was a raspberry. So that looks really cool. So you could actually just put that in there. I quite like that. At least it looks more realistic than the card, but I might hang on to the card for now. And then this also has like topping, which again, you could mix that into the slime. Hopefully you guys aren't coming to this video hoping for like a big slime kind of unboxing. I'm really just interested in the figures and displaying these. Um, but yeah, and then you have oh, like kind of the top here, which is really cute. And it's got like bunny ears and like a lemon wedge. So that can sort of clip on there. There we go, and that is the little Sunday, and that's really adorable. And then we do have one other figure. Oh, and this is rubbery, I wasn't expecting that. And this is like a little lemon wedge, so that's so cute. Um, I don't know if it really smells like lemon, 
this may be something there is this one actually on the checklist yeah there it is so this is sour wedge and it is meant to be scented like lemon that does look really cool so you could kind of hook that on the glass but i don't think that's going to work as well as like having the card or the slimes in as well i mean you could probably fit the bottom slime in you can't really have the top one as well um uh, but i would probably just keep that with my separate display i've um like a few people on instagram i've got the little drawers for my num noms to display them like this so i will probably just keep this all kind of like that and have my little sunday these are really nice um glasses by the way nice like quality i hope people don't throw these out because they're very nice you know while it's not a figure as such it's well a big figure it's very nice let's move on to the next one then so this one is the birthday sunday so this one comes with an adorable little blue candle that's so cute is this gonna have a scent i mean it should smell like wax i can't really smell anything oh it says marshmallow mm, no not really picking up much of a scent with that one um but then we have the slimes here so we have this pink one which looks more like marshmallow slime and this one which is so pretty and shimmery that looks awesome and then we have these little sprinkles which are in that case there would have been nice if they kind of were sprinkled all the way through like the other one but they're actually in a little packet and then as before we have a little blue kind of little sunday spoon this time and this is really cute cutie pie and it kind of has little decorations around there um but as before we can kind of put these in i do like that they feel the shape there so you could kind of play with them and put them back in nice little resealable tubs is a great idea um and then we have the little sprinkles that can go on top um and then we have that and it kind of looks like a little biscuit kind of on top there that's really cute for some reason i cannot clip this on for the life of me the other one kind of clipped on so maybe it's just me having a moment um but hopefully that'll clip on and that'll be kind of like that with the little ears very cute um and then the last little figure we got with that one which is bouncing all over the place is this little one it's kind of rubbery and it's like a little biscuit with sprinkles well that smells pretty good um i mean i guess maybe it's going to smell like Sounds like birthday cake a bit. Well, it says vanilla, which kind of makes sense. You would have maybe vanilla in a vanilla cake. And then here is the next one. And this was the strawberry and banana one, which I think is probably gonna be my favorite, either this one or the mint chocolate one. So this time we have like a little strawberry in the kind of lid. And we have a little purple spoon. All these spoons have little bears on, which is adorable. And we have these little cookies as well. And I actually already have these. Uh, my lovely friend Maggie sent me these in a toy trade. Um, but now these can go to maybe my friend Nicole, who also loves non noms. Oh my gosh. Oh, they smell so nice. We definitely lose their scents after a while because the ones that Maggie sent me didn't really have a scent. But it's weird how they, when they stay fresh in the packet, they smell so good still. And then we have this. I love these ones that actually kind of sprinkle about. These are definitely going everywhere. So I'm going to be very careful with that. Um, and then we have two very shimmery looking slimes. So we have this very pink shimmery one and this more yellowy one. So that's like the strawberry and banana. That looks so good. There is the cup. Let's pop these in. So these sprinkles are absolutely going everywhere. So what I might do is I might try and put them all in and then actually super glue this top bit on because I'm not really going to want to use them for anything else. So I'll be very careful with that. So right now I'm not going to put that on because they're literally going everywhere. And I'm losing all my sprinkles. Um, let's see if I can put this cap on. There we go, that one goes on. Maybe the other one I had was just a bit dodgy. Um, but that is so cute, love that. And then we have one more little character. And this one actually looks like a kind of pencil topper or like it's meant to go through a little skewer stick. And this is a cute little banana. Does it smell like banana? Yeah, it does. Really cute, this is Nancy Nana. And here is the last one. So this was the uh, mint chip sundae, one of my favorite ice cream flavors. Here is another little sprinkly thing I'm gonna handle with care, because I don't want them to go everywhere. We have, this is so cute, I love this one, with the little straws and the little bow. And then our cup. And it's got like little mints going around it. And a pink spoon this time. And then for our little characters, we have this one. She is so adorable. What is her name and scent? This is Swirly Sis and she's meant to smell like mint. Yeah, actually she does smell like sort of a chocolatey mint. That's really cool. Um, and then we have this little wafer, which is really adorable too. And this is meant to smell like chocolate, which also smells like chocolate and mint. So those scents are pretty spot on. So this looks like a much thicker slime, a little chocolatey slime there. And this one's shimmery again. These shimmery slimes are so pretty. I wonder if they're water type ones. 
Um, yeah, and then again, I'm just going to be a bit careful putting that on right now because I'm going to figure those out. I think it's another cap that doesn't want to fit. Maybe there's a different way to do it. I should probably check some videos of these, see if other people have maybe had trouble with these caps. Maybe it's just a me problem, um, but hopefully that will eventually go on there and look really cute. Um, but yeah, these are really adorable. I don't like them as much as some of the other num nums. I like the ones where you get like a bunch of like figures and the dippers I think is a really awesome series. Um, do subscribe if you're interested in seeing more num num snackables because I have all sorts of videos coming up by the way. Um, but I do love the little extra bits you get and I think the Sunday cups are really cute as well. I think they're going to look really sweet on display. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.